So I'm just going to identify once again what my A, B, and C values are. And in this one, A is a positive 1. That's our coefficient of x squared. B is a positive 6 coefficient of x. And our constant is just the value 5. So in order to find the x value, I've got a negative B, which is 6, over 2 times A, which is 1. So that's a negative 6 over 2, which would be negative 3. So in my ordered pair, I can replace the x with negative 3. And then to find the y value, all I've got to do is go into the original equation and replace all my x's with the x value, which is negative 3. So we would technically write f of negative 3 equals, that's a negative 3 squared plus 6 times negative 3 and then plus 5. So this is going to be 9 minus 18 plus 5, which I get to be negative 4. And that would be my y value. And that's it. So yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that. The axis of symmetry would be the line x equals negative 3. I guess I should have put a colon there. Uh, again, it didn't ask for that, but in addition to that, if we were to look at the graph on this thing, it would probably look something like this, where the vertex right here would be at negative... No, I put that on the wrong side. Take that garbage back. Something like this. That's better. So there's our vertex at approximately negative 3 and negative 4 with that line of symmetry. Sorry again, my drawings right here aren't perfect, but they'll do.